Okay, guys, introduce yourself. I'm Chris Cabral. I'm Kyle Sexton. And where are you guys from? Idaho, St. Mary's, Idaho. St. Mary's, Idaho. What part of Idaho is that? Is that? It's north, north, uh, just northern part. Two and a half hours south of the Canadian border. Two yeah. and a half hours south of the Canadian border. Okay. Pretty rough country up there. Rugged, bitter mountains. Okay. Yeah. And uh, uh, what do you guys do there? Uh, we're hunting outfitters. Okay. We guide for a living. And what what do you guide for? Elk, deer, bear, mountain lion, wolves. How is the health of the industry out there? Good. Uh, most of the, uh, everything else out there is all timberland, so you pretty much have to be in the woods where it didn't. Yeah. Um, the, the wolves, are they a problem at all out there? Severely a problem. They're devastating all the elk and the deer. Are you, are you guys doing a number on them? Yeah, we're doing pretty good. The, tra the local trappers are really putting hurt on them. Okay. But it'll still take a number of years to recover from yeah, what? It'll take 10 years for them to start coming back. Uh, when did the government let you start uh, uh, working on them? Uh, just last year. Just uh, last, last year was the first year. You think you've knocked the population down half? Oh, yeah. It's down severely. Awesome. The problem is a lot of remote areas where you can't get, so they got to do it on a helicopter in some places. Are they, is they allowing you to do it? Uh, the fish and Game's doing it themselves. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. What are they wanting to get the numbers down to? Are they zero or are they just... No, they're not trying to get them down to zero. They're just trying to get them so they're managed, you know, and not killing everything out there. They want them there somewhat, but yeah. the locals don't. Okay, and what kind of dogs do you hunt with out there? Walker hounds. John, did you hear that? He has walkers too. And uh, have you always used walkers? Yeah. Okay. We tried everything, but we just have less luck with walkers. I see, I see. And who do you have here with you? Oh, this is the guy's the guy's trying to break into the black gold sack. <laughs> this is Zeke and it must be good dog food. <laughs> <laughs> and what are you gonna use Zeke for? Uh look for deer sheds, elk sheds. Okay. And what what's the name of your company? Uh Russell Pond and B Bar C Outfitters. We actually have two names. Russell Pond originated in Maine and B Bar C Outfitters is the business we bought in Idaho. Okay. And do you, you still have a company though in Maine, don't yeah, you? Yeah, we have both. We travel back and forth. Mm -hmm. Does the whole family go to Maine when you go out? Uh, no, not too much anymore. Uh, I stay out and do most of the work in Idaho while my dad runs the Maine okay. business. Yeah, and w when I come out, you're, you're going to take me out on a mule ride in the mountains and oh, yeah. wine me and dine me and yeah. treat me like a celebrity? Yeah. All right. <laughs> well, I thank you for coming in. I really appreciate it. And uh, I do uh, hope that we can uh, stay in contact. And yep. I'd like to come out and just uh, visit your facility. I don't care anything about I'd like to go on the hunt, but I don't really care anything about shooting it because I'm just about the hunt. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much for coming. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Okay.